we're back and I am stoked because we have our first guest in the Intern Queen headquarters. So I'm excited to introduce you guys, someone who a lot of you probably already know. Um, I know we knew who she was, so we're excited. Um, but this is Cindy and she is a very popular YouTuber and she blogs all about college life and advice and beauty and fashion. And we were really excited um, and we reached out to her to have her kind of come join us because we thought her advice was so valuable. Um, so I will let Cindy introduce herself, but uh, Cindy, take it away. So hi everyone, as Lauren's mentioned, my name is Cindy and I am a full-time college student attending the University of California, Los Angeles. And besides being a student, I'm also a YouTuber, so I make daily vlogs on my vlog channel, Infinitely Vlogging, and then I also make, like Lauren said, college advice, tips, tricks, and beauty fashion videos on my main channel, Infinitely Cindy. And so, Cindy, today, by the way, we are going to talk about like how to pack the perfect school bag and backpack. But yes. before we do that, I just have to ask you, so you're a full-time college student, and I'm sure a lot of the people watching this want to be kind of YouTubers, you know, in their own right. Mm -hmm. How do you manage it? Like, how do you do your YouTube videos and go to school? And I don't know if you think about internships or work or whatever it might be, but how do you manage it all? For me, I kind of view YouTube as my own internship. So I'm learning every single day, and it's kind of like a job because like you do have yeah. to delegate time you have to have certain tasks you have to do I constantly like have a daily schedule and routine so I'm making time for it because it is something that is valuable to me and I think it's gonna benefit me in my career since I do want to be a businesswoman and an entrepreneur so this is kind of like running my own little show which is the perfect prep for me when I graduate after college that's really cool so I really liked what she said you guys YouTube is her internship I think that's something you guys can definitely consider I mean you could probably go and teach a social media class right you, de like, you definitely can <laughs> you could be the professor <laughs> the professor is probably like Cindy tell me everything you know um, so it is back to school so as you guys know we've done a ton of back to school videos and again we were uh, super stalking Cindy's channel over here and we're like oh she's so good at everything but we really loved like her um, like what to pack in backpacks and bags kind of videos so we thought that we could bring a little uh, a little bit of that to our channel today so Cindy what did you bring for us so I brought a backpack now I did a video on my channel on what I carry on a daily basis in my backpack. Okay. But so we'll link to that, we'll make sure to link yes, to that. Yes, so that's what I carry on a normal basis, but this is going to be a backpack that I think is like the ideal backpack for school. Mm -hmm. Like I don't have the ideal, like I'm, I'm human, so, but this is what I think <laughs> the is a really backpack. good backpack for school. And there's some things that vary with like different, you know, age groups like middle, high school, or college, but vast majority of the things will apply to anyone who's in school. Cool, let's see it, I'm excited. Let's open this up. <laughs> Do this. So let's start off with the main compartment. And in here, start pulling things out. Yeah. Real important, you want to stay hydrated all day, regardless of what age, what school you're in, or like category in school. I don't know. How would you yeah. even call that? Hydra staying you hydrated. Have to what's going on. Exactly. Yeah. Staying hydrated is really important. So you definitely want to bring a reusable bottle or just like a regular water bottle, whatever suits you and your needs. But we're all human, we need water. It's very important. Oh. Got some books. So <laughs> next we have some notebooks, some folders, some portfolios, whatever, depending on like the type of school you go to, these will usually be a staple. Even though I'm in college and I'm gonna show you the next thing, I always bring my laptop everywhere because I type my notes uh, in lectures and everything like that. But you still should bring some paper, jot some notes down, draw some diagrams, or bring like a folder. So depending on what school grade you're at, you definitely need to bring some notebooks, pa folders, papers, maybe a laptop if you're in college, but you need something to help you learn and help this school academic process. So those are your basics. Okay, so after that, now depending again on what grade level, a calculator is gonna be super important. Uh, I know I had to bring this calculator with me every single day in high school, like this was like my little buddy. <laughs> and in college, depending on what classes you're taking, you're also gonna need a calculator. And most classes, they are going to require a graphing calculator. So this is an es essential to bring to class every day. I'm like, what else is in here? Next, we have an eye clicker, and this is mainly for college students. Uh, I know some high schools actually use them where a professor or like a teacher will have a survey or have like a quiz question, and then you have to like do a multiple choice, and like that's how they will like have your pop quiz grades or like quiz grades. So, this is something 
favorite. I have never heard really? of this thing that Cindy is holding. Yeah, by it's the a way. clicker. I don't know if I'm just an old it person sucks, though. or what's happening. Wait. Like, deathly, though, because it means pop quizzes, so we actually don't <laughs> like those. <laughs> so, next, uh, vast majority of the population, we are girls out there, so we have a little makeup bag in here for some things. You don't need to bring your entire makeup kit. I know some people used to do that in my high school, like, would bring their whole makeup thing to, like, school, and I'm like, good lord. I have some essentials in here, like contact re-wetting drops. So they're basically if you're, you wear contact lenses and they get dry throughout the day or like you're staring at something for a long time, like a computer screen or something like that, this is great to just refresh in your contact lenses so they don't irritate your eyes. Oh, that's a great idea. So that's great. Some blotting sheets, you know, get oily, sweaty. Those are great. Uh, some chapstick. Some blotting powder, just so you want to blot after you use your blotting sheets. That's optional. Then I also have um, whatever lip color you're wearing and like a rollerball perfume. Just want to freshen up, yeah. especially if you have like PE and stuff or like do any physical activities throughout the day. That's like just simple, simple things help I'm like, I want to pack a bag like Cindy. <laughs> cool, I love it. So we got that. So that's it for this main compartment. Now I have like this little compartment up here. So this is where I keep my sunglasses, so if you are a college student or even high school student, sometimes classes can be far. I know in high school they're like 5-10 minutes, in college they're like 5 to like 20-25 minutes away. Right. So having some sunglasses is really nice while you're walking to class and just kind of... Gotta have the Ray-Bans. Yep, got the hoose. And mm -hmm. then also up here, just for easy access, I have some earbuds. So again, walking like to and from class, just pull these out and fade away from school. <laughs> and then here, this is just like a little thing for me, I have some cough drops. There's nothing worse than sitting in a classroom or a lecture <laughs> hall and being that person who's coughing and like dying in the corner. So I always keep these because you, you all know what I'm talking about. It happens, so those are great. Good idea. And then in the last little small compartments here, now we were talking about notes and like, you know, folders and pens and you have to have obviously some writing utensils to go with that. So here I just have like a pen, pencil, some highlighters, colored pens for like different notes, but oh, I need something to write with. Totally necessary. Then this is just because we're in the 21st century, we're all addicted to our phones and tablets and things like that. So I like to bring a portable charger with me just in case my phone dies or anything like that and also have like the charger cable to go with it. So, to me, that's I a staple need, nowadays. I, I need that in my life. Oh, I yeah. always have the dead phone, and it is not a good look. Yeah. All right, and then I have just some gum to freshen up and more lip balm. Love lip balm. Cool. All right, so next thing is I just have my wallet because, come on, you're gonna need like either your driver's license, your ID, your room key, you know, some cash just in case something happens, you need to buy some lunch. Or I know in like elementary school, I used to spend like a dollar every day on the beef jerky stand, so that's the thing. So you want to make sure you have something, just in case if something happens, you want to buy lunch on campus or after school. So, sort of finances. And then lastly, in this small little pocket, now this is just like weird stuff for me, but band-aids, you never know. I used to get paper cuts all the time, hang nails, those were bad. Ugh, so just having yeah. a couple band-aids, it's not going to hurt you. It takes up like no space in your backpack. I also have a flash drive. Again, this might be a more college thing, just so I can like save things or transfer things if I don't have Wi-Fi or internet. So that's always a good backup. I see candy. Yeah. Pick me up during the day. Just to have a piece or two of candy. You know, I don't want to load up my backpack, but to have a piece or two, I mean, school is long. It's hard. Long days. You need that little sugar pick me up. So a little piece of candy will definitely help. Cool. And I think that's it. And then I just have like some spare change in here, but. That is what I think is a good, well-rounded backpack for school. I think so too, and I know that you guys are all getting prepared to go back to school, so put together the perfect backpack. I think these things are great. I wanna go home and like reorganize my stuff, even though I'm not going to school, I'm going to work. I feel like it can kind of double, yeah, right? Definitely. Um, maybe I won't take the graphing couch. Yeah. <laughs> no. but, um, but this is great. So to check out more of uh, Cindy's content, you guys, you gotta look at both of her channels. So you have to look at her vlog and also her YouTube channel. We'll be sure to link everything right up here. Ding! and right below as well. So um, any final words to our viewers, Cindy? Yes, comment down below if there's something here that you think that might have missed or that is an essential staple for you. Definitely let us know. We'd love to you know, share and learn from each other as well in the comments below. So definitely comment if we missed anything or something that you use every day in your backpack. 
Great. Well, that's a wrap, guys. Our first guest on the Intern Queen oh. YouTube channel. Bye, everybody. Bye.